Hello and welcome to Sweet Shot Games Dota 2 Pub Stomping with Marana. Marana is another one of those very versatile heroes who can lane just about anywhere and she's very strong in a solo lane, a dual lane, and even a tri lane. So in this particular game I decided to take the off lane and I typically prefer to solo it However, we had a Witch Doctor, which can make for a pretty strong combination with Marana. I like to build towards Arena of Aquila on Marana, and if you're in a dual or even tri lane with her, then you can start right away with the Arena Basilius, giving you and your teammates some armor and some mana regen. For boots, I like to go phase in a solo lane, and then power treads in a dual or tri lane. However, mana boots can work too if your team really needs them. I like to max out Starstorm first since it will give you really good damage for team fights and farming creeps. Put a point into each of your abilities, but max out your Sacred Arrow second and your Leap third, and then get a point into your ultimate whenever you can. Marana's stun can be difficult to land sometimes, so try waiting until you're closer to throw it, or wait for a teammate to set you up for an easy opportunity. However, sometimes you're just going to have to throw it out there and fish for an opportunity. Marana's leap ability can be very useful, and used in many different ways. It can be used to run away or escape, or to close the gap between you and an opponent. It can also be used to dodge abilities, auto attacks, and even disengage a tower from attacking you. Marana's ultimate can also be used in many different ways. Here, if I had used it sooner, I might have been able to save my teammate. However, I was also able to use it to gank the enemy and pick up two kills. When you're grouped up with your team and pushing or in a team fight, Look for an opportunity to hit as many targets with your Starfall as possible in order to maximize its full potential. And don't be afraid to stay in the fight and auto attack. Marana is a very strong semi carry and can put out some very good DPS. Marana's ultimate is also very good when you or your opponents are attempting to do Roshan, it can sneak you in and out unnoticed or it can be very good for baiting your opponents into a team fight. Because Marana is such a versatile hero, she can also purchase many, many different items. So, depending on your game and your situation, try to evaluate the game, your team, and your opponents to decide what item would work best for you. If your supports are having a tough time saving up money, you might want to pick up a Drum of Endurance or even a Mechanism to help your team out. If you need more utility type items, pick up something like a Force Staff maybe, or even an Orchid of Malevolence which will give you good attack speed, damage, and the ability to silence an opponent. Also, if you need more survivability, you can pick up a Manta style which will also give you some good damage or even a Black King Bar which is always good. However if you're just looking for damage there's a ton of options so I'll just let you get creative and decide what's best for you. Now go stomp some pubs with Marana and let them know how you got so pro.